Futuristic has been my name since I was like seven years old, to be honest. Uh, I was just hella young rapping, and so my brothers called me the future, but I'd rap really fast, so they're like, yo, that's futuristic. Can you rap something for me right now? I'm telling you, I got it. Anybody thinking different gonna get it? Futuristic, be that nigga killing every single city, grabbing titties, even if they ain't even people shit, even they like a blah, blah, blah. Yes, futuristic. So, what was the most amazing thing that happened to you being in the series? Um, I think just uh, it was my first like headline world tour, and they caught a lot of that footage. So, yeah, going to Australia and Europe and all across the country and having to be my own tour. Yeah. Dope, dope. So, is there anybody that you want to work with? Now that you've done your um, film or your series, is there someone that you just on the top of your list now that you are getting recognition and things of that nature? Um, collab wise, I'd love to work with John Bellion, Childish Gambino, Andre 3000. A verse from him would be insane. Yeah. So what, what made this, how did this series come about? Like, why did you decide that this is something that you wanted to have filmed, like showing your day to day and how you got to be futuristic? Um, I think, you know, a lot of my fans, they, they see they see some stuff. But so when we were approached to do the independent series, it was like I knew it would give them more of an outlook of the hard work and, you know, the dedication that really goes into the show that they see and the music that they see, you know, just gives them a bigger appreciation for for what we do. And they can relate more because we're all just regular people like I go to my house and, you know, I see my family the same way anybody else does. And then I go to work, but my work is just a little different, you know. So I think it's just a good way to relate with the fans and kind of tell my story and relate to them through mine. So what would you tell people if they were going about trying to get, you know, signed? Do you think being independent is better than being with a major label? I think it just depends on who you are. For me, I'm like kind of a control freak when it comes to certain things. And I like, I like the fact of putting in the work. And if I put in all the work, I get all the reward, you know. So everything falls on my shoulders. If I fail, it's on me. If I win, it's on me. So for me, being an independent artist and just being able to do what I want, how I want, when I want, it's the only way I could really go, you know. And I'm not saying I'll never sign, but for this amount of time, you know, independent has definitely been a better look for me. So where can we find your music right now? You can find my music everywhere. Uh, Spotify, iTunes, Apple Music, uh, YouTube, you know, your mama's phone, your grandma's phone. Not your mama's phone. My mama ain't listening to Futuristic. Oh, she might got a song on there. <laughs> <laughs> so where can we find you on social media? Because now I have to follow you now that I've met you in person. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's uh, at Only Futuristic on Instagram, Twitter, just Futuristic on Facebook. Yeah, but at Only Futuristic. So if I follow you, you better follow me back. Oh, yeah. Because I'm going to slide in the DM. I'm going to like two pictures. like. <laughs> Thank you so much. Okay. I appreciate you.